Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Orford Castle. Home to the wild man spirit. I think I'm saying that right, the wild man. Sorry if there's any wind interference during this video. I'm pretty high up as it is. Good evening guys, so this is going to be a different type of video tonight. I'm at a castle for the very first time. I'm not able to go inside just at the moment because it's not open during the week. However, I will be going in at some point in the future for a video on the inside. But tonight, we're going to be focusing mainly on the outskirts of the castle itself. The Wild Man of Orford. Orford Castle resides in Suffolk within South East England not too far from the sea of Orford Ness. All that remains today is the magnificent keep described as one of the most remarkable in England. Henry II built it during the 12th century to consolidate its regional power. I nearly said church things, I'm not used to doing castles. But look at that. That is insane. I've been here many times, what was that? had a crash just over there, there I'm in a village so I wouldn't be surprised if it's villagers um so yeah tonight the main area that we've got are these steps leading up to the main main door but as you would have heard at the beginning I'll be giving you information about this place throughout the night through editing so I don't need to remember it all now but I do know the outskirts especially that rather than the inside of the castle is home to the wild man not long after the keep was constructed it held a wild man described as a merman who was taken from the sea he caused quite a sensation by prompting many to create carvings of wild men in local area churches using bapt baptismal fonts so the plan is tonight to do my best to try and contact this wild man, um, find out who he is, see if I can contact him at all, um, and yeah, see what happens, I guess. Okay, I'm going to start with your... by sticking down the cat balls on the steps, see if I can get any response. Okay. That middle one hasn't stopped going off yet. That's, that's constantly going. Could you stop that from going off for me, please? Okay. All right. If there are any spirits here that wish to communicate with me, Possibly the wild man at all. Please come and tap one of these plastic balls, please. Don't worry about that tapping, guys. That's just uh, my the cap for the camera. Are there spirits here that you'd rather not communicate with me? Or do whatever you like, just show me a sign that you're here. Like a bang, a knock, a push, or just knocking one of those balls over. And may one of these cat balls light up if you want to tell me your name, and then we can do that with a different piece of equipment. to leave the cat moles where they are. 
I'm just going to go up the stairs. Which means I feel less safe. I should know, more safe, I should say, actually, coming up to this door. It definitely won't be open. I know that much. But I'm going to put the ramp pod at the top of these stairs by this door to see if any spirits decide to walk out. Is it going to go off because my arm? have gone off. Nothing yet. If there are any spirits here that would like me to leave, just walk out of that door up there and I will know if you'd like me to leave. And we all know that that REM pod works now. No question. It's just whether the, the walk, the walking man I think that's what it's called. I, I probably called it several things in this video. Called him several things in this video. It's whether he wants to show himself or not. If there are any spirits here at all, anyone, please just come and tap that green light for me. Just to show me you're here. Okay, I'm gonna walk up the stairs. If you if you want to just stand on the step, I'll walk past you. Having spent a day trawling the waters of the Suffolk coast, they noticed that their nets, the fishermen's nets, were unusually heavy, and they discovered a strange creature caught up amongst the fish. It resembled a man, but its naked body was covered with hair, a long, shaggy beard, and a bald crown. Over the days that followed, the castle governor attempted to communicate with this strange prisoner, but to no avail, apart from a few grunts. The wild man of Orford, as he became known, would say nothing. They fed him a diet of raw fish, from which he would always wring out the moisture before eating. They even took him to a service at Orford Church and were perturbed to discover the sacraments meant nothing to him. 
So I'm going to leave the REM pod up there. I'm going to have a quick wander around and find somewhere else to continue the ghost hunt, the investigation into the wandering man or the wild man. Like I said, I'm still, still not getting it right. If we hear the REM pod, if the REM pod goes off, I'll definitely be able to hear it. No way I wouldn't be able to. It's so loud and echoey where I've left it. Oh, there's the dungeon area. It's upstairs. It's up right up there. That's where the dungeon area is. So I, that's where the wild man or the wandering man was kept when they tortured him. So I wouldn't be able to investigate that very well. But I... Let's change everything. Just switched on night vision. We're not going to have long because the battery is dying on the camera. But I'm going to walk back around the EMF to see if it goes off at any particular point. I admit it is difficult for you guys to see. But if, it, if I do see it go off, I'll stop where I am and switch back to regular so you can see the area it went off in. The EMF hasn't gone off at all, but the wind has stopped. I didn't even come around a corner, it just stopped. Like, dead. Weird. Okay, to round off the investigation of the wild man on the outskirts of the castle. I'm going to sit up here with the spirit box and I'm going to play a solo card game. See if I can speak to anything. I don't know how long that ca this camera's got left until it dies. Uh, I've, uh, you got, I've got a po torch pointed at me so you can only just see me. And behind me over there is the REM pod. And if I move my arm like that, I'm not saying it off. So if it goes off, it can't be me. Oh, well, at least I don't think it can be me anyway. Let's go with the spirit box. Is there anyone there that wants to speak to me? Are you the wild man? Can you tell me your name? Hey. Is there anything at all? Tell me who you are. I don't know. Maybe it's a... If you don't know who they are, they know it's a wild man, maybe... I don't know. Are you in trouble? No. Are you just saying hello? Hello. 
think I found like no death storm, just no, I couldn't work out. I don't think there's anyone that wants to talk unless we unless I was talking to someone who didn't actually know who they were. Like they didn't know who they they're trying to tell me who they were, but they couldn't because they don't actually know. Maybe. Mystery. No, it'll stay a mystery until I'm able to hunt the inside of the castle. Just as I'm about to set up the card game, the EMF has started to go berserk. I literally just laid it down, nothing happened, and then everything started happening. stopped completely now it knows I'm recording. Okay. I'll move it to there. So we can still see it. I'm gonna set up the card game now. The moment I turn my big light off, literally as I turned it off, I did nothing for like five minutes while I was setting this up. Clearly something is here. I've got a cat ball and the REM pod there as well. So let's see if it activates it. This may look slightly different to what you've seen me do with Harry and Ollie. But basically this is the solo version. So I'm going to, instead of having 666, it's just, it's just a basic star basically. That's, that keeps going off. I don't catch it in time, like it's trying to taunt me. Okay. Are there any spirits here that wished, would like to communicate with me? No. Am I not welcome here at this castle? Yes, I'm not welcome. Am I speaking to the wild man? Maybe. Is it rude to call you by the wild man? Is it offensive in any way? I don't know. So I might be, I might not be. I try not to give anything up, no matter what. Can you tell me who you are? No. Are you the one that's been causing all the sounds around me tonight and not activating any of my equipment on purpose? No. One day I'll be back to investigate the inside of this castle. Will you be there to greet me? No, I don't know. Are you not always here then? Maybe, who knows? Spirits can travel places. It depends whether they're bound by it or not. 
Am I in danger the longer I stay here? Maybe. Well, I thank you for talking to me tonight through the means that you have. I will leave now because I'm sure that's what you want me to do. And I will come back one day. But just tell me, do you want me to leave now? Yes. That's insane. I didn't know what that card was. I didn't know what any of them are, but that's mad. Okay, you want me to leave. Well, thank you, spirits, for talking to me tonight. I don't know who you are, unfortunately. I couldn't help you if that's what you needed at all. But I appreciate you talking to me, and I will get out of your hair, and I will leave you now. As I turn the camera off. Every single time I turn the camera off. Every single time I turn the camera off, it's like it just—it wants to—it wants to, but just off camera. Every time I speak, it wants to speak. It wants to be off camera. For some reason, that doesn't surprise me. Look how dim my torch has gone as well. Like my torch battery is being drained, or something. Insane. Well, thank you, spirits, for talking to me, and I'll get out your hair now. Why has this happened to my torch? It's on 43%. It shouldn't be dim as, as dim as this. Look at that. You can't even see it. You can barely even see it anymore. Why does it do this? Why is it doing it, I should say? However, he seemed relatively happy at the castle, did not attempt to escape, even when he was taken to the sea for a swim. After a few months, he began to grow restless. One day, when his guidance took him for his customary swim, he slipped beneath the surface and was never seen again. And somehow forgot to record an outro for this video. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I very much did. Um, there's still a mystery to uncover with this wild man and I will be back one day. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Well, I really did. So yeah, make sure you subscribed, like the video as always. Um, expect, it's been MDS, expect the unexpected, and we'll catch you guys later. Peace.